Welcome to Salesforce Atlas. I uh, hope you're doing well. And in today's episode, I would like to share with you how to create a formula for visually displaying your opportunity status. This can be used on uh, any record page, any, any object in Salesforce. I'll be using a custom, a custom field uh, called uh, project status. And again, the name of this field can, can vary. It really depends on what you're trying to build. But the focus of the video is uh, the traffic light system that will visually show you just very, very similar to my colored squares. Now I'll be sharing my screen. And, uh, and uh, as always, I'm in my, one of my um, playgrounds here in Salesforce Trailhead. And uh, I'm already in setup and uh, in the opportunities page. Now, as I mentioned, you can build this uh, formula field on any, any object. Now, what I'm going to do, I will create two custom fields. So one is going to be for pick list values and the other custom field is going to be for a formula for actually displaying the traffic flight system. And uh, let me just go ahead and uh, create a new field. And it is going to be a pick list, pick list field. And uh, let's name it. All right, we actually have our project status. And, and for this, for traffic lights, I'll be using, I'll be using red, amber, and green lights and values. Now I will just go ahead and save this field and um, just save it on all layouts and then click save a new. And uh, the second, second field is going to be a formula field. Select new, click formulas and next and name your new field. called, I'll just use one of the existing labels, project status summary. And then this is going to be a text, text type, select next. And in advanced formulas, insert the formula. I have prepared it on the side. So I'll just go and copy paste it and just explain you what exactly does it mean. Now I have created a new field, project status with the picklist values. So here's a case formula. If the project status field is showing green, so let's say a traffic light, if it's green, then Salesforce has provided with the existing images similar to um, colored squares. You can just use this existing formula and it will also show traffic lights in your org either in sandbox or production org. It's going to be green for green. Um, I will change this to amber, amber for yellow and red for red. And just check the syntax is right. We have no errors in here. And I will just select next and next again and save that to all page layout of to all layouts. And this should be ready. I can go and test it. Now in my, in my user interface, now from the user users page, I am again in opportunities and uh, you can use the field, you can use traffic lights either in list views or your reports. And I'll, I will just add it in here. So to my all opportunities, I will go ahead and I will select fields to display. I will want to select my new two new fields and it's going to be project status and project status summary. Select save. And here they are, project status, project status summary. I'll just increase this and now what I can do just to test it, I'll just go and mass update some fields. And as you know, you can, with one click, you can actually update 
um, several fields. I'll select, I'll select green for these fields and apply. Now here we will show, it will show a traffic light system. Now this is a traffic light system. Um, it can, images can really vary. Um, maybe it is easier to see just the, let's say small colored squares or circles or flags. There is also a formula for, for flags, but for this, um, for this video, I just wanted to show you that you can also select the traffic light system and it will really depend on your imagination where you can use the traffic light system. Let me just as well populate this to, to amber. Update all. And as you can see, I have some more images in here. I have green, amber, and then let's also add some red traffic lights. All right. All right, actually I have removed my amber ones, but as you can see in here, I'll just quickly make an update. And uh, as you can see in here, this uh, will be showing, let's say it is in opportunities and my opportunities project status, or it could be opportunity status is in either green, amber, uh, or red. Red as um, there maybe are some issues and uh, it's going to be a closed lost opportunity and you would need your management to jump in and support your users with the more difficult opportunities and let's let's just remove the project status now i'll just completely remove it and i will leave only the summary field now if you look at it you will you can better see visually which which opportunities are doing very well and uh, what is going to happen if i just go separately to this burlington's opportunity as I have added, I've added the traffic light system to our page layouts. And I guess I can see it in here as well, project status summary. Now you can move the field to the very top or to your highlights panel. And I know that for many users, it helps to, to visually see which opportunities are doing well and which aren't doing as well and to act on it. Hope you found this uh, quick video useful about um, tra traffic lights. I will be sharing with some more formula fields and uh, other images that Salesforce have provided for us to use. And uh, thanks a lot for watching. Please uh, like, share and subscribe and uh, see you next time. Bye.